Shalom. Peace and love, everybody. It's your boy, Sir Fuku. Now you already know we align with the divine every time we make a video. Now, this video is very important. I know I say that a lot, but as far as the times that we are in, protecting your energy, being cognizant of the information and being open to ideas and just all around just being aware of your surroundings it's extremely important and it's, it's extremely important that you know this information that i'm about to present to you because when you start connecting these dots a lot of things start to make sense and you start to understand and understand you know how you're supposed to react to certain things and what you're supposed to be doing in times like this because it's a lot of shit going on for real for real and it's very important that you protect your energy. Now, let's get straight into it because we're going to basically be talking about all the connections between the coronavirus, 5G, chemtrails, all that stuff, because it all ties in at the end of the day. And it's a lot like it's so much information. And usually with my videos, I even got notes because usually in my videos, I freestyle. You feel me? I go straight off the dome because a lot of this shit is just straight in my head. And I get the downloads just like that. But it's so much information with this this disease and this virus and all this stuff going around. You feel me? You just got to... It's a lot of information. So that's what I'm about to present to y'all right now. So the official name for the disease is COVID-19. That's what it's called, the coronavirus, which is COVID-19. And the first case of the coronavirus was in Wuhan, China. You feel me? And... Going on about, uh, you know, the connection between 5G and the coronavirus, the first week, you mean, actually, the third week after they, actually, you know what, <laughs> Let, let's start this over, because uh, it, it's so much information, I don't really know where I want to start as far as, you know, all this, but here's where I'm going to start, okay, uh, we're going to say baby steps, um, in 1981, right, there is a book called the eyes of darkness yeah it's called the eyes of darkness 1981 where they literally predicted the coronavirus they predicted it happening in 2020 and they predicted it happening in wuhan china where the infection started you feel me so so if they predicted this in a book you gotta you gotta start thinking you know what i'm saying you gotta start going within and trying to figure out information because Everything, you know, that these, the government is telling you is not going to be, you feel me, just exactly what they say. So you got to start going in, going within it and taking in information. So, right. The first infection was in Wuhan, China. This is also where they tested the first 5G towers. I didn't notice until I started doing my, my research. The first 5G tower was placed in Wuhan, China, right? Three weeks after they placed it, with the first person was infected with coronavirus. Three weeks, okay? Now, if you don't believe me, go do your own research. Everything that I say in this video, go ahead and study to show self-approved because I don't want you to just go out with the information that I'm presenting to you and just regurgitating. I want you to study for yourself so you know that what I'm saying is true for information because I'm not here to tell lies to anybody. I'm here to literally just present information and present present the message to the people so the base of the virus is the flu the coronavirus it's the flu that's all it is and when merged with another disease aka like aids or hiv then it becomes a coronavirus all right so you gotta understand you feel me that like the chemtrails the stuff that they spray in the air which is nanobots and nanotechnology they spraying metals and all these other kind of things in the air, which is literally lowering your vibrations and your frequencies and weakening your immune system, dropping your pH levels. All this stuff is connected. It is doing that so that when an actual virus or the corona, you know, does come into contact with you, your body is already susceptible to that happening. So that's why it's important. Actually, we'll get to that soon. But, you know, just so you know, like, just start looking up in the sky. They playing tic-tac-toe. They spraying this stuff to weaken your immune system, weaken your vibrations and your frequencies, okay? This is all a part of the preparation. They started spraying these things, these chemtrails, 
they started setting up 5G towers so that you can be weak. It's all a part of Agenda 21. If you ever heard, it's called Agenda 21. Check out the Illuminati car games. It's all on there. The information is all there. So anyways, I started doing some um, etymology. I was trying to figure out what did Corona actually mean, right? Turns out Corona actually means crown. What is crown? Your crown chakra. What times are we living in? The times of revelations. Okay, crown chakra, revelations. What does that mean? The return of Christ, the return of Christ consciousness within the people, a mass awakening. So what could the coronavirus be? Could this mean the Christ virus, the crown virus? Is this something, the opposite force, the opposing force? Because there is a, a force from Mother Nature coming unto the chosen ones. You know what I'm saying? Releasing this kundalini energy with inside their pineal gland. You know what I'm saying? That basically is awakening people up to who they truly are, coming into knowledge, all this good stuff, right? This is the return of Christ. You know what I'm saying? Basically what it is. And the coronavirus is here to try to calcify your pineal gland and manipulate the forces dramatically. So when it affects your electromagnetic brain waves and frequencies, you will go down in a vibration. Everything is based off fear nowadays. Fear is extremely, you know, powerful, especially when they can, uh, make people believe a certain way because i think it's very important at this time that we know that the disease probably isn't even the biggest thing you know the biggest thing right now is probably the people you probably want to stay away from people because their reaction is a controlled reaction it's not necessarily their reaction they're reacting how these elites and how these higher ups actually want them to react you get what i'm saying so the actual Let's get into 5G because I wish I would have mentioned this a little bit earlier, but I hope you sticking with me through this video because it low key might be all over the place, but it's information all over the place. But 5G, that's what I'm saying. I was doing my research and the actual term for 5G is microwave radiation frequencies. Let me say that again. Microwave radiation frequencies. These 5G towers are producing microwave radiation. Just sit and think on that for a second. It's the same shit that we cook our food with. And if you know anything about microwaves, it doesn't cook your food from the inside. It cooks your food from, oh, apologies. It does not cook your food from the outside like a heater. It cooks your food from the inside out. So what does this mean, y'all? Right. If we have cell towers producing microwave radiations and you are on the acidic side of the PA scale, you're not living in a high vibration, your insides are not clean, you have an acidic environment inside you and around you, these microwave frequencies can literally start cooking you from the inside out. Simple. So protect your energy. This is like, like I was saying, it's literally preparation. Like, it's like, it's like chess right now. The elites are playing chess and everybody is just a pawn. So you need to be the one-eyed man, the king, seeing everything with 2020 vision. This is what we've been talking about for the longest, y'all. And we're literally seeing these things play out in front of our faces. So stay away from people, right? Stay away from the masses because they're going to react exactly how you think they're going to react. The reality is going to eventually shatter right in front of their eyes. Please charge. Whoa. Nah, but seriously. So get your body on the alkaline side of the PA scale. Anything above a 6.5, anything above a 7 is the alkaline scale, anything on the 6.5 and below is acidic. So eat your fruits and vegetables, 
keep a clean, balanced, healthy diet. You know what I'm saying? And you're going to be fine. This coronavirus is, it, at the end of the day, it's real, right? It's a real thing because it's already happening. It's in China. But when people are being fear-mongered and propaganda thrown in their face all over social media, all on the news, all over TV, you know what I'm saying? It, it's going to get to a point where people are so scared and it's literally going to become a reality. People are going to start to get symptoms of the flu, right? And they're going to start thinking that they have the coronavirus. And they're going to convince themselves that they literally have the coronavirus. So protect your energy. Detox your body. Like now is the time, y'all. Get you some detox pills. Start boosting your immune system. Stay up in frequencies. Stay away from the bots, the NPCs, you know what I'm saying? The soulless beings that don't understand because this is the rebirth of a new world. Like I was saying, the coronavirus literally means crown, y'all. And the coronavirus also, I forgot to mention this, but this is almost like the icing on the cake at, the, at this point. Because when Kobe Bryant died, right? <laughs> Actually, I forgot to mention this too. Listen up. If you type the word Kobe in hebrew right you can literally go on google translate type in the word kobe right translate it into english it literally means corona kobe corona kobe corona you get in the picture now i mean that's just something to meditate on but 11:44. anyways I think that's all I have for this video right now. I want y'all to stay up, stay bliss, protect your energy at all times because, you know, it's a, it's a lot going on and it's very important that, that you're doing this and I, I care for you. You know what I'm saying? If nobody rooting for you, Sir Fook will rooting for you. And just likewise, you feel me? Everybody have a blessed day. That's all I got for you. More videos dropping soon today. Stay up.